Hello and welcome back to uh, a first video of sorts that I've been making now. And it's going to be called, the series, it's going to be called How to Play TTT Better. Uh, this idea was brought to me by Pyro, but sadly he does not want to help me record this anymore. <laughs> Uh, so as we start out here, we're going to be seeing a fast forward right off the bat. Um, just setting a position, I grab a sniper and I go outside because I like using the shadows on uh, on this map. And as right here, you see I use the windows in my advantage and I pick off the snipe. And I even check the scoreboard to check it. And I think we're going to hit another little fast forward here. I believe I started off with, um, with uh, body armor. I think that's what I wanted to buy first. Body armor and a knife. I don't think sadly I use the knife at all. Uh, another speed up, looking through windows, trying to figure out who my next target's going to be really because it's, uh, it's a little confusing seeing all this stuff going on. I don't know who I can shoot, what I can shoot right now, and spook people out. Uh, right here I'm just trying to act normal like I'm an innocent, you know, going off, doing random stuff, not acting suspicious by being alone or not talking. So I'm getting into this uh this um group talking talking and they're just hanging out so much it's bothering me I need to do something so just just take my time don't pressure patience is really good take the shot walk away change weapons no one will see you just keep walking they'll see him because it was right next to him now I'm over here just chilling out looking at uh my options again because they're still crowded up but a little bit more spread out now because someone got sniped. So I think right here, yeah, I want to switch to my rifle and I'm going to go back in and uh, check the situation. I believe I'm going to look down some hallways and see what's going to happen. I think I might speed up right here again. Checking out Pyro. I believe uh, what's going on right now in the server when they're talking is basically they're trying to figure out, okay, what's going on? Who shot him? And then they don't, they, they just stop caring, really. And they go back to normal. I speed up here because I find this guy in the garage and I want to kill him with my knife that I have but he's calling me out so I don't want to take the risk of I I kill him and then I'm instantly KOS'd because there's no point in that it's just gonna it's gonna get you killed if you rush things so again take a break I go outside and look at my options again and so I finally run all the way over here and here's a big point in the game for me I decide to by disguiser. Uh, that will help me because if you see right behind me where I'm going, there's a lot of shadows. And right here I believe I point out that death was in the shadow, even though I uh, didn't notice it quite at first. I'm going to walk back up here and realize. <laughs> and he should be, yep, right about there. And you're going to see him pop up. And I already activated disguiser because I have it hotkeyed. I don't it's not really important if you have disguise or hockey, it just helps out. And I pick up the pretty lucky Deagle shot on him, and uh, his unid body just sits there. Um, one thing I do decide right here, however, sorry for the creaky chair, is to grab his body and put it out in the open war. And um, some might be saying, well, why are you running out there unid or hidden and putting bodies everywhere? It's because I do not uh, want him so close where they freak out and they start looking so instead I put him further out so I could snipe anyone who goes up and IDs now this is this is weird I don't he just, just walks right past an ID body I don't get it but hey I'm not complaining it keeps another MIA and you want you want to keep your MIAs up for a good amount of time uh, right there I tag the guy then go back in the shadow so he can't see me then I pick him off he's dead next guy's freaking out he's saying no 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 Again, another headshot, take him out. Keep going. Uh, radar. That's another big turning point is radar. So now I know where the last few are and I can systematically go one by one and kill them off or kill a small group of them. And right here, um, I don't know why, but I think that's for some reason people are going to come outside and I'm going to be able to pick a few more off, but that's not the case. So uh, as I speed up here, run back in the house, see what's going on see some people uh, I believe I actually fast forward through a kill that I got there I just walked up to a guy sniped him and just walked away real quick like didn't make sure no one uh, was bothering me so right here 
again that guy is still in the garage i i decided to figure out uh what to do right here because i really want to want to do something and i tell my tea buddy all right right here i believe all right let's kill him yep kill and him, then pyro got dna on me from that guy I sniped in the hallway so he starts trying to kill me whoa uh, that's a uh, <laughs> loud audio bullshit. right there um right there Ooh, that was a scary trade i uh got caught up in trying to kill him and didn't realize that i left pretty long DNA on that body so it was a little silly of me yes, so right now <laughs> I'm surviving with six hills just trying to live and uh, stay <laughs> stay away from everyone and I'm trying to call out my own tea buddy almost because Ambro believes he's the last alive but that's not the last innocent alive rather and that's not true there's still uh, one more tea buddy so I'm saying yeah just kill him you know help me out but really <laughs> he should kill him but you know, can't do that. So there you go. I decided to buy a Jihad here because I finally figured out a way to deal with this guy in the garage. And it's pissing me off. So uh, I'll let you see how this uh, pans out. <laughs> Death. <laughs> and that's what happened right, and that was my eighth oh, kill this. and then my you trader buddy yes. picks it off that is what I'm so in that about. case one that for one trade about. six health still got the guy definitely worth it there you go eight kills uh seven points team bonus eight got a lot a lot of kills and that was a good game